we are going to look at the life table functions, the notations, and important relationships need to construct the life table. Before we start, let's recap. We know that S0x is probability of a newborn survives to h x tpx is probability of a person h x survives d years tqx is 1 minus tpx also equals to probability of a person hx dies within t years these are the important probability when you want to estimate the life tables general life tables will look like this You will have here x and here lx, where x will represent the age of the populations and lx is representing the total number of populations for each x. The populations will start as l0, where 0 is representing a newborn. Usually, you will have L0 is the number of initial population. Hypothetically, L0 will usually be easy number to calculate such as 1,000, 100,000, 500,000, 1 million and so on. There is nothing wrong if you want to start your life table with other numbers but this is not recommended for ease of the calculation. Now let's look at the important relationships to construct the life table. Let's say we have L0 equals to 1000. Draw a timeline here. This is in years. Here times 0, here is at times x. So over here I have L0 equals to 1000. And over here I have Lx equals to 750. So, I can easily get the probability of surviving from 0 to x by taking 750 over 1000. So, S0x is equals to 750 over 1000. Therefore, I can conclude that L0 times S0x equals to Lx and S0x is equals to Lx over L0. This is my first relation. Okay, now let's move on to the next one. I know that tpx is equals to s0x plus t over s0x. From the above, I can write s0x plus t as lx plus t 
over L0 and S0 X I can write as LX over L0 this one can cancel and after cancel out that I will get LX plus D over LX this would be the second relationship the third one would be TQX from the above I know that TQX is 1 minus TPX which is also equals to 1 minus LX plus T over LX I can write this in terms of LX and LX plus T where it is equals to LX minus LX plus T over LX let's look again at the timeline where I have L0 just now as equals to 1000 and LX equals to 750 this is for time X time 0 is in years the number of people die here is 250 so to get to 150 I took L0 minus LX this is equals to number of death between 0 and X so if you uh, look at this one and you look at equations number 3 you can see LX minus LX plus T it is also the number of death between x and x plus t these notations for the number of death for this one we denote it as x d 0 where 0 is the starting age which is this one and then x is the uh, period that you are looking into which is this this is equals to number of So, for this case, we can also say it is also equals to T dx over Lx. Okay, that's it for today. We'll continue in the next video. Thank you.